okay? Now, let's move on. Okay, so check this out, guys. This beautiful Japanese, I'm believing that it's silk. So let me show, it's vintage. Let me show you the tag. But it is so gorgeous. Check it out. It's really long. Hold up. It has the real the dragons on the front. Here. But check out the back. O M G. Isn't this gorgeous? This is so beautiful. So beautiful. Let me try to get a little closer so you can see up close. Isn't that beautiful? The thread is hanging a little bit, but I'll cut that off. Cut it off here. I'm not going to pull it because it may pull up, but I'm just going to take that off. But still, overall, it's in pretty good condition. Let me try it on for you guys. Model it a little bit. There you go. Look at it. Anyway, you get the gist of it. Here's the back. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I love this. And see, it's pieces like this that you find. Now, if you were to go to a boutique or to a regular store, I don't think you're going to find something like this in a regular store. So, when going to the secondhand stores, this is what you're, you, you can experience in finding. Pieces like this. Even on the shoulder, guys. Look at that. Oh, what can I wear it with? Do you have to ask? You can wear this with anything. You can wear this with a tank, a tank dress. You can wear it with jeans and a tee. You can wear it with, as a cover up. You can even wear this by yourself, by itself. If you close up the front, take a belt, wrap it around, and maybe wear a pretty bralette underneath or a slip dress underneath. You can work it. Work it, guys. Work it. Work it. Okay. We are going to move to accessories now. Oh, let me show you this. I did show you this when I'm wearing in another video. And it's this other oriental shirt. It is a men's shirt. Look at the print. And it's long enough. I can wear it. It has, will have worn it as a dress. If I get to, you know, feel a little bit like I don't want to be, I want to be a little bit more modest, I'll just go ahead and wear shorts like what I have on biker shorts or some shorts underneath. But it can be worn as a dress, depending on your height and your size. Okay, so we're getting to accessories and I need to get moving. Scarves. This is all silk. Love it. Feels so good on your skin. I love silk. But yeah, pick up the scarves that you find. They have these plentiful in all of the stores that I go to. Real silk. And guys, you don't have to wear it the normal way. What is the normal way they used to wear scarves? Maybe around your neck, like that. Like that, maybe. Maybe. Or you can wear it in your hair. 
I probably won't wear it with my fluffy hair. But you could. When I wear my braids, I'll just wear this over my head. And I have a video, guys, where you can wear it as a top. You can take it, fold it, category-wise, sidewise, till you get a, a triangle here. And, of course, wrap it around like that and wear it that way. Have a video or a picture showing you how I did it. You will love it. I'll have to uh, have it down on screen where you can go find that video. Okay, lots and lots of accessories. I love accessories. Guys, I know you have. Tell me you have seen my video where I did the earrings. Now, it's not for everybody, but it's just what I like to do. I'm a crafty person as well. So, I make these earrings... Made them, love them. Gorgeous. Wore, I will show you how I wore them if I have, if you haven't seen how they look. But also, I found this little flower. Didn't make it, but I found it, and it has this, these um, strings attached to them, or straps. I'm assuming it's a strap. The whole thing is made of leather. Can you believe that? Leather. And you could probably wear it. Let me put that away. You could probably wear it like this. On, Of course not with this. But if you have another blouse or something, you can wear it like that. Hmm, maybe it might go with that. Like this. Or you can wear it around your neck. And tie it wear it that way mm. oh yeah wear it that way wear it in your hair if you choose to wear it in your hair there's different ways you can wear it but yes florals are in and they really add a pop they really take your Outfits up another level. Accessories. Now, found these. Found this little flower. It just looks so real to me. It was just in the bin. Isn't that gorgeous? That is so pretty. Wear it in my hair. Wear it in my hair. Just like that. Guys, especially for the summer. You need to get out in the summer and look as tropical as you can. I mean... You're somewhere where it doesn't have to be a pair of shorts and a t-shirt. Come on, fashionistas. No, no. Flare it up. Put it on. This is gorgeous. This is so pretty. So I threw it in my little bag. I said, I can do something with this. And I'm going to. I can make it out of a pen. And I showed you how to do that as well on the video. But thought that was really pretty. I found um, these glasses. Check these out, guys. Elton John glasses. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Tell me I'm not popping with this. Mm. These are nice round of course if you feel like it doesn't fit your face frame but you know what you have to do guys you have to try things out and don't be afraid of trying on things that's different from your normal from your normal um taste or your normal choices try new things i love these love them Check these out. I nearly died. And they were only $2. Get ready. You ready? Oh. Oh. Yes, I'm here. Oh, 
On the side? Okay, here it goes. Yes, darling. These are fabulous, guys. Fabulous. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Listen, y'all with me? Are y'all feeling me? <laughs> Come on now. Come on now. That is how you look different from everybody else. Step out of the box, guys. I keep telling you. Don't be afraid to be different. Everybody's the same. Be different. Don't conform to what everybody else is wearing and doing. Make you you. Okay. Jewelry. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Look at all this gold goodness. Let me go one at a time. This is a belt. And you guys know what I've said about belts. Belts do not have to be worn one way. But this I found at the Goodwill retail store in the jury section. It is actually a belt. It has this little clasp on it right here. And you adjust it to your size, how you want to wear it. Let me see if I can connect it. You wear it. This is another way that you can add some pizzazz. Of course, not with this, guys. Of course, not with this. I'm just showing you. Showing you how to wear it with the right outfit. Let it lay on your hip. If you don't want to wear it on your hip, bring it around the breastbone. Wear it around there. I can get it fastened it has enough of these where you can put them in as far as you want no that's not tight enough let me try this one more time like that maybe you want to wear it up under here like that like that or Wear it as a necklace. You can detach this part here if you decide. I don't want to really wear it as a belt. So you can detach this here. But take it off enough where you have enough so you can hook it. And wear it as a necklace. Wear it as a necklace. Wear it as a necklace, guys. Oh, let me get it to lay right. Here we go. There you go. That's much better. Okay, like that. Okay. Can't get it to lay because I got it a little twisted. But yeah, there you go. Wear it as a necklace. Mmm. Oh, yes. Guys, I'm telling you, this is how you become a fashionista. You're trying new things, you're doing new things, and you're brand new. Yes, you are. Here's another one I found. Now, this is not a belt. This is an actual necklace, and it's a lot heavier. This one here is like a plastic kind of thing. Or acrylic kind of thing but this has weight in it right here I don't think this coat is real gold I'm sure it probably is not but that's just besides the point and this is costume jewelry guys so it's not something you're going to be wearing all the time so yeah this is another piece you can wear around the neck you take this off here, turn it around, and there you go. Wear it like that. Saw that one and said it's a belt. 
saw this one say it's just a regular necklace couldn't turn them down they were crying in the bin please take us please take us don't leave us we're a family okay i'll take you both and i did it this is another one really nice lightweight but heavier than not as heavy as the last one but check this out gold chain chains 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 this is a belt but you can wear it as a necklace a long necklace and look at the pretty stones on the end oh that's so pretty here's the hook right here and it's an actual belt But yeah, I would wear this as a necklace, but I wouldn't wear it as a choker. I would just wear it like that. Have it hang down like that. And wear it that way. Oh, yes. Okay, and the last chain. I had a lot of chains today, guys. This is the last one. This is lightweight. But check it out. It has black in it. It has black silver and gold this is really nice and it has a toggle this is actually a necklace here thought that was really really pretty i got this from a goodwill retail store so yeah all of these things just want to really bring that outfit make that wardrobe distinctive and different from the typical everyday get up and just throw something on wardrobe it'll take you soaring high yes it will okay let me get with the purses moving on quickly this bag i'm not sure i showed you guys but if i did forgive me because sometimes this girl be forgetting what she be putting out here and i don't want to even say oh she showed that in the last video well you gotta see it again okay i love this bag it reminds me of a fendi i don't know who makes this pattern but i love it I got my things in it, but I meant to show you guys this bag. It's a chocolate brown and kind of a olive color. It has a drawstring here. Did I show you guys this before? The bottom. Love it. Love that. This cute little bag here. Lord, it's a straw bag. Check it out. It's vintage. And has a little handle here. It's like a little little basket. The bottom has feet on it. Chocolate brown. This is a beautiful color. And on the insides, it has a like a drawstring lining on the inside. Like that. That's how it opens like that and then when you get ready to close it you just pull the drawstrings together and push back in and there you go okay always like leopard's print cheetah print just a case, a clutch. Love it. It's full leather, clean in size. Has a um, a wristlet handle. Everyday use. Running in and out, or wearing for a night, date night. You want to look chic. Love it. This bag, found at the Goodwill. Which one? Outlet. There's a lot of coach bags that's in the secondhand stores. I don't know, maybe the older styles are not as expensive as the normal. But what's a classic? I still say they make things better back in the day than they do now. But anyway, check this out. This is beautiful. Not quite my style, but I love it. I love it. 
gorge, gorge, gorge. Here's the bottom on the insides. You have your your tag here with all the information. This is vintage. Love that. Love that. Okay, guys, we're going to get with the shoes and then we're going to be out of here, out of here. These cute little sandals. Love these. Aren't these the prettiest little things? Oops. One's trying to get away. It's camera shy. I don't want to be seen. I don't want to be seen. Well, you're going to be seen. Aren't those cute? I just love the red pop of color here of the flower petals. Really, really cute. This is a statement piece just alone. You can wear an all white sundress or you can even wear this sundress that we shown earlier or maybe one that you have that may have this color in it. With that, love these. Pretty good condition, barely worn. Found those. These, love these. I've already sold these. <laughs> I've had them for a while though. I, no, no, I didn't. Let me say, I had them for um, the Goodwill pile, but um, got these from the Goodwill retail store. These are uh, Rebecca, Rebecca Minkoff, genuine leather. Has the studs on them. Really, really pretty. They're so. Okay. Shoes. These shoes. <sighs> Goodwill Outlet. All the rest of these, um, except for one, maybe two pairs, is from the Goodwill Outlet. These shoes. Check these out. Oh my gosh, it's nothing like a pointy toe shoe. And they have, um, I don't know what they call, um, mohair maybe? Skin? These are so sexy, guys. I love them. I already have a pair. Let me show you. Hold on, one minute. Actually, have several kinds of animal print shoes. Hold on. Okay, I've got these here. They're kind of beat up, but I don't care. These here, a leopard print. And I have these. A zebra print. These I've had for a long, 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 long time. I need to take them to the cobbler because the insides are getting kind of rough. But I don't care, guys. Hey, who's going to take my shoes off and look in my side my shoe? These are cute. The print. That's what they're going to see. And if the heels come off, these are the lifts. You can buy them from Amazon. Put them on your shoes. Don't walk around with click, clack, clickety, clack, clack, click, 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 clack, clack. Fashion Vogue, never, never wear the metal on your heels. That's a no-no. Just like the movie, Iron Hangers. See that movie, Mommy Dearest? <laughs> Don't do it. Okay, moving on. These, Goodwill Outlet. Another pair, Snakeskin. These are Guess. The brand Guess. Absolutely gorgeous. Kitten heel. I can wear these in class all day. Because Sister Girl like to look chic when she goes to school. As you guys see my videos. I don't go to school wearing jeans and a t-shirt. No. No. Now, if you do, if you're a teacher, more power to you. Wear what you want to wear that makes you comfortable. For me, Sister Girl, mm -mm, she ain't stepping out that way. I can wear these nice sling back guess shoes. Goodwill outlet. 
and the caps are still on. A lot of times when I find these shoes, the caps are off, so I know I have to put a lip on them. Moving on, check these out, guys. Whew. I told you the Goodwill outlet was banging. Check these out. How sexy are these? Let me just get one for right now so you guys can really get the feel of This is clear. Clear. And they tie around your ankle. So sexy. Oh my gosh. And got this cap, velvet cap toe, and the sides are clear. Ooh. It's a fast fashion brand, but it's the aesthetic. It's how they look, guys. The back. Check them out. Velvet. Tell me these things. Tell me these ain't the bomb. Oh. Those that's with me. Y'all with me. These. Another pair. The outlet. <sighs> do you guys get excited when you find things in the thrift store? <laughs> I do because this is my passion and I just love it I guess if you don't have a passion for fashion you maybe can't understand but I think you understand where I'm coming from check this out oh my goodness they're a wedge you can stand in these bad boys all day and your feet will not hurt they won't you've got all this platform that's giving you more support than a stiletto they're gorgeous. Wear them with sundresses. Wear them with wide leg, long, long pants. Wear them with whatever you want to wear them with. But wear them and wear them with some sass. Be fly. Be fly with them. Moving on. For you more conservative, but even being conservative, you can still be fly. These little sandals here. Genuine leather. Comfortable. I love the color of them. And they're from a brand called Brand X. Y'all hear that? Genuine leather. And they're so comfortable. Oh, I'm telling you, the Goodwill outlet was kicking it, and it wasn't on the best side of town. So, you know, some people just, the crowds may not go there. But hey, when it comes to fashion, I go anywhere to find a good deal. Okay, guys, we're almost done. We're almost done. Found these shoes. Maybe a lot. Please forgive me, and I don't want to offend anybody. These look like what uh, Egyptian or Indian people would wear. If you're an Indian person, please, I'm not trying to. But maybe Egyptian. I may be wrong. But you know what? I love these. They're just flat. They're all leather. A flat shoe. They're almost like my Peter Pan shoes. And didn't I tell you those shoes are comfortable? They are so comfortable. These are comfortable. and low and these pull out you can wear them flat like this or take them out and wear them like that come on guys here's the bottom it was from the goodwill i guess they had a long time ago but Got from the Goodwill outlet. And there's a little thing on the end here. I don't know what that may mean. But yes, this would be a pop of color. Maybe you wear this with all black. Or one, um, what do you call it? 
monotone outfit. Throw these bad boys on. Your pop of color. Your steak. These. It's funny. These sequin ballet flats. Now, I'm not that much of a fan of ballet flats, but I see they're trending and they're coming around. I really don't care for the round, round toe. And the reason why I got these is because they have a little square at the bottom. But these are gorgeous. Sequin. Love them. And this is from a brand. I think it's Adrian. Adrian. Papel. Adriana. Papelli. Something like that. But I don't care. They are gorgeous. I wore them today. Can't show you my outfit of the day. This is, I changed since I was out earlier. But love these guys. Love these. Love these. Love these. And they were in perfect shape. No sequins missing or anything. Okay. And last. In my other videos. I told you guys about these. Found these bad boys. These are called um, shoe trees. That is the correct name, a shoe tree. They fit your shoes. You slide them in your shoes to keep your leather shoes in shape. Or if you don't have leather shoes, and if you have a pair of shoes that's a teeny bit, maybe a half size too short, you can put these in there and they will stretch. And I had a pair of loafers that, um, I don't think they were genuine leather, but they were full leather. And I had them just sitting in there for a while. And after I took them out, they had the shape as well as they had added extra space in the shoe for me. So, yes, these are the shoe horns. Um, I found these at the Goodwill. Yeah. And they had a yellow tag sale, so I only got them for half price. Yeah. And these fit most of my shoes. I don't think they have the size on here of the shoe horn. But um, you can kind of get a feel or idea if they will fit your size of shoe. If not, I will put them in my husband's shoes. And I believe, guys, that is it. That is it, my lovelies, my sass thrifters. I'm so glad you were able to come back and join me. I just thank you guys for just supporting me, the beautiful comments that you leave me. I am so appreciative. And you know what? I try to get to mostly all of them. And um, you're just so sweet and so supportive. And I'm doing this not just for me, but I'm doing it for you too. Because I like to see, I love to see us looking at our best. And I always say that even if you don't feel the best, throw on something that will make you feel good, feel better. If not completely, but just for a minute and seconds, you will look good even though there's things going on in your life that doesn't make you too happy. But don't worry, things tend to work out. But dress and just be you. Just be you. There's too many people that's trying to be like everybody else. Just be you and use the creativity that God has given you. So I'm so glad you joined my channel share my videos let other ones know that we have a good time on my on my channel and i will be back with more things that i found i'll be back with more um lookbooks i'll be back with more hauls going out in these streets i'm supposed to be going maybe out of town in about a week or so so i'm going to be looking for some um thrift stores where i'm going because i always do that and find out some more goodies for you guys and just share what I find with you okay so until then guys shop shop wisely and always remember to live fashionably ever after and I will see you on the next video